Welcome back to A Night in the Woods. We're back with May Broski, I think. I can't remember her last name. It's been a little while, for me at least. Wow, it's wow, it's been literally 36 hours since I've been online. This shall not stand. Well, I mean, that's pretty oh what the hell. Ah no! What is wrong with you? Damn it! I bet Angus knows how to fix this. He's all computery, I think. But I can't let him see this. Where does he work again? That's awkward. Um, how do I... How do I get away from the virus riddled... Okay. Alright. Off to... Get the computer fixed, I guess. And we're judging Angus is smart because he has glasses, I guess? I think he does. Alright. Oop. Anything over here? Morning, bird. Wait, how do I... How do I look at you? Oh my god. There we go. I've never liked this bird. Why not? It's cute. Hey, hon. Yeah? Come say hi. Oh, okay. What's up, mom cat? Read about more eels? Morning, mom. Nope, I'm mom 24 hours a day. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Also, it's 4 p.m., sweetie. Holy crap, that's... Never slept at 4 p.m. in my life. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Oh, is he your little friend Greg's boyfriend? Big guy, kinda quiet? Yeah, that's him. I need him to fix my laptop. Well, he better, sweetie. You can't afford to buy a new one. Wait, do you even know Angus? Do you? Uh... Mom, we are in a band together. Sorta. Oh, is the band back together? Yeah, we practiced last night. I don't think we're ever gonna play, though. Hmm. Well, that sounds like fun, honey. Yeah, I guess. You don't sound too happy about it. Eh. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Have a good time, daughter. Thanks, 24-hour mom. <laughs> Seven days a week. God. <laughs> I think the parents are my favorite characters right now. Got a call from your Aunt Molly. Ugh, what did Aunt Mall Cop want? Sweetie, I really wish you wouldn't call her that. She worked very hard to get where she is, and it's a dangerous job. Oh yeah, Possum Springs is so dangerous. Anyway, did she tell you about the sever arm we found? She did, in fact. Scary things. Yeah, I guess. Honey, I know this is home, but please be careful out there. I will, Mom. And come home after dark, unless you're... That, I don't know why it's based on that. And come home after dark unless you're with somebody. At least until they figure out what happened. Okay. Thanks, sweetie. I'm gonna keep talking to you. Deal with it. So, honey. Yeah? What did the arm look like? It was cut off, like, right above the elbow. Was there blood and stuff? Jesus, Mom. A little bit, a little bit. I wonder whose arm it was. Well, it should be pretty easy to spot. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what happened to your arm? I dropped it by the diner. Here, sir, I found your arm. <laughs> Thanks, I was afraid I'd never see it again. People don't always return arms when they find them. It's a real shame. It's a cold world. A cold, cold world, sweetie. <laughs> uh... God, I love the dialogue. Alright, let's go find Angus. Have him fix my computer. That. Oh! Hey, you kid! Oh, no. Um, how is an old man voice? Hey, you kid! Adult? So you're back, eh? That sounds more like villain voice. Yes, Mr. Penderson. Didn't last long, eh? 
No, Mr. Penderson. You get a job yet? Yes, I've been elected mayor. Ha! Huh, couldn't do worse than the current one. And I've ordered your house to be bulldozed. What? Finishing the job you started? Oh, there's a story there. I hope you enjoy living in the woods. Those eggs took the paint off the vinyl siding. Scavenge food. Commune with beasts, Mr. Penderson. Watch yourself, little miss. Little effing miss? No one's forgotten who you are and what you did, you know. They may act like they have, but that's just small town polite right there. Is that what this is? Small town polite's all you got, kid. So watch it. Well, that was really interesting. But I need to go listen to my cells die. Pa. Pa. Jesus. You're an angry old man. That's... There's a lot of angry old men in the world, though, unfortunately. Come on, climb a tree. Can't stop me. Whoa. There was a dialogue up here. I remember the time in ninth grade when I snuck out and could see into Tom Bradwell's bedroom. <laughs> yep, that sure did happen. Okay. Any dialogue up here? Okay. Poke around the, the rooftops so you can get anywhere interesting. Oh, I've, oh, I've kicked an acorn. Oh, and scroll grabbed it. All right, that works. I have no idea what the point to going up here is, but oh, laundry, ghosts. We see things differently. <laughs> Ooh, spooky laundry. Oh, I bet I need to do like the triple jump. Nope, that didn't. Nope, shit. Alright, fine. Let's go talk to everyone. <laughs> because I'm OCD, I'm going backwards, yes. Just make sure I didn't miss anything. I guess there's like no one on this street. Yeah, that's. That's fine, nothing missed. Hey, Selmers. What's it like being back? Well, I just got home, so just like taking it all in. Feel like anything's changed? Nah, not really. Same old, same old. Same people, same streets, same trees. I wish I could get away. Where would you go? Want to go out to the ocean? Get a stable job that pays worth a damn? Make jewelry out of things I find on the beach and sell them? And do karaoke every night? Can I come visit? Can you karaoke? Does it have to be any good? Don't matter, girl. Just gotta show up. Alright. Now that sounds <laughs> like a decent life. What's up, dude? This is my property. But it's my street. You ain't changed since you was a kid. Okay. Cool. Man, no one likes me. I wonder what she did. Like, why all the older folks in town are so pissed at her. And then, like, why did she drop out of college? There's so many mysteries. Around this 20-year-old college, well, former college student. So I forgot to go into here last time. Let's poke around the underground. See what's to be seen. Oh. Uh, fisherman, apparently. Pale white tunnel fish. Easy to catch and so delish. That's good. Oh god, you were listening! <laughs> Alright. Trolley side news. Pretzel and pierogies. I'll take a pierogi. Hey, I just got back in town, and the one thing I missed most was... Hey! I remember you! Hello! Thief! What? Oh, come on. That was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. Alright, you know what? 
this isn't even a restaurant. It's a crappy food stand in a hole. This establishment has been in business for 50 years. 50 crappy years in a hole. You know what else has been in a hole for 50 years? Dead people from the 60s. <laughs> no respect, no respect this one. You can keep your whole pretzels. Your damp pierogies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go jump in the river. God damn. Ooh. Can I... Can I take a pretzel? Oh, okay, I can just comment on them. It's like, that'd be weird to steal a pretzel after all that. Ooh. Mining town poster. And a bunch of little graffiti on it. But she doesn't want to talk about it, apparently. Alright, well, fine. That was exciting. Getting yelled at by a pierogi stand owner. Alright. Let's see if we missed anything. Oh, possibilities! Oh, video. Oh, hey, video plus two. That's where Angus is. Uh, you're not Angus. Can I help you? I don't think so. Can I help you? Okay. Well, where's Angus? Not okay. Fine. I guess I'll find Angus elsewhere. Guess he's not working today, or at 4 p.m. Uh, oh wait, is there anything else over here? There's too many pathways. I have to keep backtracking because I don't want to miss a thing. Eh, it's gonna make the the day a little long. Statue. Old pickaxe where B works. Can't go in anything. Okay. Poor Telezoft workers. Yep, nothing. Alright. Oh, we can't go up the stairs. No. My god. What kind of weather did I miss? This is nuts. Oh well, wasn't going to church anyway. This place is falling apart. Apparently when the stairs go out of order, yeah, stuff's falling apart. Oh, can I jump up there? Okay, come on. One, two, three! Nope. One, two, three! Ah. Maybe I have to wait till like, the stairs are repaired so I can run from up here. Does he have to do three? Jumps. All right, fine. Whatever. The secrets up there will have to remain secret for another day when I can figure out how to jump. I can almost jump as fast as cars though, so that works. Okay, so Angus isn't at work. Maybe he's at his place. So where does he live? Ooh. Can jump on possibilities. Ah, okay, fine. I just want to jump on everything. Hey, dudes. Better take shelter. Here comes the smelters. No use hiding. Smelters will find you. That's kind of creepy for a football team. Or I'm guessing it's a football team. Alright. Uh, I'm actually going to see what's behind the Snack Falcon. Oh, that's where he found the arm. And I feel like I... Missed out on clues. I just want my computer. I need the internet. It's more important than whatever's out there. Alright, fair enough. Wait. Do you have more to say? Yeah, okay, fine. Fair enough, man. So I guess I'll have to bug Ang er, bug, bug Greg. See if he knows where Angus is. What's up, dude? Um. Hey, May! Got cups on my ears. Why? Was thinking about how they have beaches in Bright Harbor. And then I was thinking about the ocean. And then I put cups on my ears. And it sounds like the ocean. Wow, dude, you took me on a journey. Speaking of, uh, nothing, I guess. Do you know where I could find Angus? At work, at the video store. What do you want Angus for? Got computer problems. Figured he might know a thing or two. He's a hacker. 
Really? I'm pretty sure he hacks. Wow. Cool dude. I'll catch you later. Definitely. I'm so glad you're back. So that arm, huh? Jeez, yeah, what the hell? What do you think happened? I don't know. How does an arm end up on the sidewalk? In Possum Springs. I mean, kind of cool, but creepy. And like, two doors down from our apartment? You live in Townie Center now? Townie Century now? Yeah, we live next door. Haha, <laughs> man, you've been away for a long time. I have. Thanks for reminding me. Get for hanging out later? So much to catch up on. Nah, I got to deal with the family. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? A friendly thing. Is it 6 o'clock yet? No. Alright. It's Fiasco Fox. <laughs> Alright. But we know Angus isn't at work. Maybe he'll, like, be there now. Maybe his shift started. I don't know. We'll just give a quick hop back there. Because this is clearly the fastest way to travel. Oh, wait, here we go. You are still not Angus. Can I help you? Where's Angus? Oh, he works day shift? Is it day? I got here early? What the hell? Wait, why does everything you say sound like a question? You do the same thing? I just didn't comment on it? Really? Yeah? Huh. <laughs> Alright. Night shift, huh? That's cool. I'm at home with my baby during the day until my mom gets back from work. Ew, babies. Pretty cool job, though. Or job, though? Get to watch movies, eat candy, meet cute guys? Ew, cute guys. What's wrong with guys? I don't know. Cute guys are overrated. Oh, you broke her poor heart. And music, I guess. I don't know. Alright, so I guess we have to bug him out of his apartment. Please be home, Angus. I want my computer fixed. Help me. Is this one, then? Okay. Uh, okay. Guess I'll just poke this. Ah, oh, oh, wait. What? There's no button? Huh, there's gotta be someone to make this work. Alright. Click. Hello, hello? Hello? You're not Angus. Who's this? Who are you? May Broski. What are you selling? Do you get a lot of people selling you stuff? Hello? Click. Alright. Click. Yes? Uh, hi, Angus? Angus, you say? Dude, it's May. Tell me about yourself, Maybelline. This isn't Angus. Would you like it to be? Nope, bye! <laughs> God. <laughs> Alright. Nick. Maurice? May. Angus? May? Yeah. You're not Angus. And you ain't Maurice. I'm glad we sorted that out. <laughs> okay, these are kind of entertaining. Click. Hello, Angus? Are you searching, my child? Yeah, for Angus. You can search all you like for Angus. Everyone has a different Angus. For some, Angus is a happy marriage. For some, a good career. For some, a fancy car. Angus is a guy named Angus. He lives here. My child, no Angus will ever compare to the one true Angus, the Lord God above. Okay. Dear, have you encountered God this day? Look, my mom works at the church. I'm in the club by default. Alright. Hello? Hello? Hello. I'm looking for Angus? Any idea where Angus lives? I believe he's at number two. Written on the button, I think. It looks, uh, broken. I think the little guy who lives with kicked it. 
Uh, why? Greg? Or something. How? Beats me, kid. I just live here. Alright. Uh, well, it sparks every time I push something, so maybe if I, like... Oh, shit. Click. Hello? Ah! <laughs> Who's this? Hi, it's May. May? Yeah, May. I just got electrocuted. Oh, yeah, it's fiddly. There's no button! Yeah, you can, like, stick a screwdriver in and... Well, it's too late now. Uh, come on up. Alright. Oh, I actually have to wait for the elevator. Fix my computer! Ooh, almost super under shit. Uh, I guess I can't. Don't mind me, I guess I'm poking around your apartment. Anything I could- nope, nope, okay, fine, I'll guess I'll talk to you then. Whoa, come right in. Hey, dude. Uh, welcome to our apartment. I could have been in my underwear. Hey, dude, don't wear pants on my account. Why was the door unlocked? Greg always forgets to lock it. Greg's at work if you're looking for Greg. I was actually looking for you. My laptop is messed up and I thought... What's wrong with it? Lots of things pop up when I turn it on. What kinds of things? You know, <laughs> things about things, not for kids things. <laughs> Why didn't you bring it with you? I forgot it. Mm hmm. You know, May, you don't ha like have to be embarrassed about. I'm not. I mean, everyone. I know. Let me see what I can do. How are you gonna fix my laptop when it's not here? Like, I think May kind of had oversight here. Okay, got something for you. Plug this into any USB port and restart. Should clear up you right up. It might delete some of your old files, though. Wow, thanks, dude. No problem. Gonna head on home. See if your magic works. It's not magic. It's just ones and zeros. And we're just atoms. And our perception of reality is just chemical reactions. Take those away and poof. There goes the universe. Jesus, Angus. Whoa. Sorry. I'm gonna go. Oh, hey, I didn't have to walk all the way back. Angus. It's a full page spread. Awesome. I'm gonna have to collect all the drawings at some point. That's gonna bug me if I don't. What's up, Dad? Hey, Dadders! Why, if it isn't the mayor of Possum Springs herself. <laughs> Wait, did he talk to... Did he talk to my neighbor? <laughs> what did you get up to today? Hung out with Angus a bit. You remember him? Oh, yeah, I like Angus. He's smart. In the old days, I used to work with his dad. I know they fell on some hard times after y'all got laid off. Used to see him at the bar. Yeah. After I stopped drinking, I didn't really see him as much. I wonder how he is. Did they find out anything about that arm? Not that I heard. Huh, well, be careful out there. Maybe I should carry mace or brass knuckles or something. Well, it'd be a shame if you got into trouble and were unarmed. <laughs> oh, I appreciate the dead. No, I think it'll be okay. Yeah. What? <laughs> Just waiting there for her to get it. Ah, okay, I get it. Unarmed. Eh? I'm going to bed now. Good night, Mayor Kitten. Good night. That is absolutely my kind of humor. Oh, I can't talk to Dad anymore. Okay, fine, I'll go to bed. Have you moved the boxes yet, Dad? Nope. Ah, I want to see what's behind the boxes. Just move them already. That's all I ask. Nope, oh, wait. No books? Alright. Then let's see if this does its magic. Let's see if this Angus fix works. Can't get any worse, at least. 
I guess it could be on fire? Anyway. Oh my god, it's fixed! Yay! Donut Wolf. And have a happy, like, radish. And little shark. How do I... <laughs> oh my god. That's so dumb. I love it. Bright Harbor Gazette, Secretary of Education. Having public schools like having public hamburgers. That's insane. Everyone should buy their own hamburgers. Um, that, that's a little too real. I'm not okay with that. Yeah, no, let's, let's move on from that. Uh, oh. Hey, you get that porn off your laptop? Oh, God. I heard you broke it with so much porn. Dude, you know it. Rick Wreckage told me that before the internet, they'd hide porn in a hollow log in the woods. Yeah, that was a thing, right? Be awkward if you're hiking out to the porn, and some dude was already there, and you're like, Sup, dude. I guess we're both here for the porn. I bet that happened. You know it did. I bet they became friends. Porn... Oh. Shit. So apparently asking Greg about the porn crashed the game. Um, it also has been crashing every single time I try playing this, so I'm going to rush through it real quick and hopefully it'll be good. Also I'm not going to ask about the porn. It's just too risky. Oh my god, it's fixed. I can use the mouse for this part too. Hey, you get that porn off your laptop? I heard you broke it with so much porn. Did not. I can smell your lies. Why must you turn this internet into a den of lies? I deny everything! So dude, you come to the party tomorrow night, right? What party? Up in the state forest, lots of people home from school and stuff this weekend. Cool people, the big fire, the snacks, the beers. Girl, you know I will. Girl, I'm so excited. Woods are so fun at night, I'm gonna get so wasted. There are no laws in the woods. Cool, well you should ask B if she can drive us. What? No, I don't think she likes me. Nah, dude, she's cool. She drives us all the time and lets us borrow a car. Stop by her store tomorrow and ask, please. Okay, whatever. Yeah! Alright. Well, that hasn't crashed yet, so fingers crossed. I guess it turned out okay then, your computer. Yeah, it did, thanks. I put something else on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? Oh, wow, yeah, I used to play that like. All the time, like 10 years ago? I've been playing again. They've kept updating it. You can grab your old save game from the server and start right where you left off. Ooh, cool. You should check it out and we can talk Demon Tower sometime. It's still, it's really cool still. I am deaf doing this. Aw, oh, thanks, Angus. Tips had. <laughs> Born to lose, country trash, proud drummer, skate and destroy. Skate to create, bound for glory. All right, and that's. I guess I can't click on anyone else. Okay. Uh, it has not crashed, so now I'm tempted. Should I play Demon Tower and risk it, or should I just end it here? Probably should just end it here. Oh, what was the? Oh, no, I don't want to use the laptop. I want to go to bed. I want to go to bed and end this day. There we go. Bedtime? Yeah, definitely. Oh, That's so cute. And on the dawning of the new day, we're going to call it here for the second episode of Night in the Woods. Hopefully the third episode will have less crashing, and less computer viruses and porn, and more parties in the woods. <laughs>